So today I want to talk about formats. Uh, what I mean by formats is that uh, I'm going to talk specifically about this uh, six by a painting is that when I was painting this outside, I had a choice of painting this way or this way. So that's a choice you have to make uh, when you're painting. And I'll zoom in in a second. You'll see it much bigger on the screen. But that's a choice you have to make when you're, uh, when you're painting outside. Are you, are you uh, trying to interpret that, that scene in a certain way? Do you want to show its vastness or do you want to show its intimacy? And that will really depend on the scene. But what, what I'm trying to tell you here is that you can turn your canvas either horizontally or, or vertically anytime. And even, you know, don't go out there thinking, okay, I'm going to be painting a bunch of horizontal, you know, uh, six by eight paintings. And that's another thing to make sure, you know, you have a um, different size of canvases out there. And, uh, because you never know what the scene is going to uh, throw at you, what, what you're going to find basically, kind of that's the big uh, overarching uh, picture here. So, but even on a, on a, on a canvas that's, a, you know, a small six by eight, you have, you have a choice. You have a choice to turn it, flip it this way or that way. It doesn't matter now if you're in the studio or outdoors, it's not per se uh, about outdoor, this pose is not about outdoor painting, but it's more about format design of your of your of your painting this particular painting uh, I just loved the uh, some of those logs down below and the the water the reflection obviously as sort of a supporting elements and it was more about the texture uh, this was fairly I, I laid the uh, the paint down fairly heavy in the uh, on the on those rocks and uh, it was more about definitely about the celebration of the medium here too just uh, enjoying uh, oil paint, as, as you can see, as I'm kind of zooming in on this painting. And uh, so again, make sure when you're, it doesn't matter if you're painting outside or inside, you know, look, look at that canvas, turn it, you know, look, look through your, you know, get your finger up and, you know, look through your little made up little viewfinder. And uh, you might be surprised that uh, what you, what you find, uh, sometimes certain scenes that you thought might lay down better horizontally, they might work better vertically. Uh, most landscapes generally tend to be more uh, horizontal. They kind of lend themselves to be, but there's nothing wrong with even having a square, uh, uh, a square piece of canvas with you. So make sure when you go outside, give yourself an opportunity to you know play with the. Play, play with the canvas and having different size of canvases with you. Not actually different sizes. What I meant to say is uh, different dimensions. You know, it could be a real horizontal one, uh, mo more maybe a really vertical, a real skinny one. It could be a square. So give, give yourself ample opportunity to think about, about design, um, not just the actual scene. And I know when we're outside, it's, we're thinking a lot about what we see but let's think about design too uh, when you're standing in front of that easel uh, in front of your subject matter.